We're in our apartment that we rented. <laughs> I guess that's what it's called. Airbnb. You see Airbnb. <laughs> and look, look, look. The toilet is in the same room as the shower. <laughs> All right, I'm using my phone because we are going out and it looks like it's gonna pour. So my phone apparently is waterproof. So I will take that with me for some videos and pictures. And then we can have be wet, I guess. Well, Lisa won't be wet, she has an umbrella. But I have a jacket and it has a hood. So there we go. Okay, so we are going to the Fault in Our Stars bench in the rain. No one else will be there. Not entirely sure which, uh, which what bench it is. <laughs> but we're gonna go see if it's this one. So we passed the bench already. It's like right next to where we're staying, basically. <laughs> there it is. Next to the diamond. <laughs> yep, beautiful. Hmm. Unless it's like going that way somewhere. Well, if it's at Leipzigrad and Kaisergrad, like it, this is it. <laughs> but maybe it's on that side. Uh, maybe. <laughs> oh, I'm still recording. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's possible that this is the bench. We're really confused. <laughs> of course, now it's sunny out. <laughs> so that was not the fault on our stars bench, neither of them were. That's okay, we think we know where it is now. And then, so we were completely soaked, and we like, well, my jeans were soaking in my shoes and my socks, so we took them off and hung them in front of the window, and we were blow, I was blow drying my shoes. And then we were just sitting on the couch, and it was just quiet, and Lisa was like, we made mistakes. <laughs> it was hilarious. Because it's beautiful out now. <laughs> so, we're dry now. Um, and I have to bring my backpack instead of my purse because my purse is still like soaking wet. So, that's fine. We're going out again. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. <laughs> okay, we're pretty sure we found it. we found it, but there's people at it. There it is over there. There's two people taking pictures at it. But it's that one right there. See, there's the wooden door and the black door and the stairs that are behind them. In the, in the, when they're sitting at it. Why are they just standing there? Leave, move on. Let other people use it. <laughs> they're not even sitting at it. Super lame. Look, there it is. <laughs> Ooh, ah. Ooh la la. I don't know. We should probably go either way and there will be things. Okay. For some reason, the streets confuse me here because um, I feel like if we need to go that way, we can't get there. <laughs> <laughs> So Amsterdam, as it turns out, is very difficult to navigate. <laughs> it's really confusing. <laughs> We're ready to eat. <laughs> And get drunk apparently because they were so much vodka in my glass that they got me. <laughs> and I've already had sips and added more sparkling water and it still is really strong. <laughs> okay, so Lisa and I are trying to buy tickets to the Van Gogh Museum because that one you don't have to buy two months in advance. But if you buy them in advance you don't have to wait in line. And we were both trying, Lisa was trying to buy them on her phone and when you hit the tickets like part two of buying tickets button, it doesn't do anything. So I was like, let me try my phone. You read you weren't under 18. And it doesn't work. So I tried on my phone and it still doesn't work. So I'm boxing my boyfriend in Canada <laughs> so that he can buy them for us and then email the tickets to us. <laughs> Would you like a media guide? Well, the um, exhibition prints in Paris in 1900. It's available in a bunch of tons of different languages. What? A media guide? Five euros. I feel like we can just look ourselves at things. Yeah, we'll just look. No, we'll just look at things ourselves, but thanks for asking. Look at the view from our Airbnb. Look at... 
The canal is right there, and the Tipio's bench is like just two blocks that way. I'm drunk. <laughs> <laughs> We're walking to the corner, to a corner that we haven't been to yet. So take that. Oh, it's so much nicer when there's no people. I know. <laughs> Thanks to Anthony in Canada, who bought our tickets for us. <laughs> we made it. Hooray. Did you like the Van Gogh Museum? I did a lot. So did I. We weren't allowed taking pictures though, so I'll just have to remember everything really well. Yeah. Um, but no, I liked it. It was really interesting. We spent an hour and a half looking at everything, so that's good. Um, I really liked it. There was like parts where you could, um, it had like letters that they, you could listen to, and those were really good. Yeah. And just like... <laughs> I'm really disappointed that Starry Night is not there. I thought it was gonna be. Yeah. You know, being the Van Gogh Museum and all. <laughs> Apparently it's in New York, which yeah. is ridiculous. So that was disappointing. <laughs> But it was good. I also bought things. <laughs> I pretty much wanted to buy everything in the gift shop. <laughs> it was nice. Also, we learned some interesting information that a lot of people is a lot of people are incorrect about. Because I've always heard that Wango cut off his ear and mailed it to like the love of his life, but he did not. He tried to give it to a prostitute, and then they called the cops. Okay, let's go find lunch. What what are the, what are they called again that we need? Bitter ballin. Yes. We need to try bitter ballin. We haven't had it yet. And it's the thing I need to have apparently. <laughs> Alright, we found somewhere to eat, but we don't think they have bitter ballin. So hopefully we'll find somewhere for dinner that has it. <laughs> They do, they do have it. We thought they didn't, but they do. Look, it's right here. <laughs> it's the bitter ballin. And a very beautiful little dollop of mustard. Yep. It is very beautiful, actually. I'm gonna take a picture of it. Okay. Take I feel like really, it's gonna be super hot. Take a really small, careful bite. <laughs> should I dip it in the mustard? Yes, you should. It's really good. Okay. They won't be very hot. They're really hot. Yeah. <laughs> it's good though. <laughs> it's like really creamy inside. Mm -hmm. My whole mouth is getting burned right now. <laughs> It's very good though. <laughs> nom, nom. <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember the meal I had last night for supper? It was literally just a sandwich. That was the same price as this. And this has like an actual amount, good amount of meat on it. Plus it has a fried egg, which is gonna be glorious. And bacon. Ooh, and bacon. And this is lunch. I want way more food for the same price. This is way better. I recommend this restaurant. This is what the restaurant's called. Take note. I'm so glad I'm with Lisa. She's all navigating. <laughs> if, I was by my, if I was by myself, I'd be like, I'm just gonna stand here. <laughs> well, there's the Anne Frank house. <laughs> and there's the long lineup.
liked the boat. Yeah. You liked the boat. I liked how casual it was because there was like six of us. Yeah. Or something. I wasn't counting. I think but they were like eight or ten. Me, yeah. But there weren't a lot of us, so it was just very casual, conversational. It was good. I liked it. So now we're walking, and we might get pancakes because the boat lady recommended pancakes. Yeah. Also, she grew up in Canada, so that was kind of cool. Yeah, in Toronto. <laughs> in Toronto, yeah. <laughs> It. There they are. There's our apple bacon pancakes that the girl on the boat suggested. Yeah, it was. They were called those damn boat guys. <laughs> Lisa is full, so I'm finishing her pancake. <laughs> look, look, we got a little claw keychain for free with our meal, and Lisa let me keep it, and I'm so excited for it. <laughs> Yay! Well, that's why I think you should keep it because you're way more excited. <laughs> so I just, I just took a picture of one of the canals with like, so you can see part of a bike in it. And then there was a girl standing next to me and she was just standing there all quietly. And then it was her bike that I was putting in my picture. And now I'm embarrassed. <laughs> Another thing that I really like about where we're staying is where we need to go to get places is like where we know where we have to turn is at the bench. So, the, the Tiffio's bench, so it's just cool. So we pass it many times. <laughs> See, there's the bench again, there it is. Ah! <laughs> Bye bench. There's lots of two alleys behind me. I like it much better over here, there are way less people. <laughs> Man, it was busy over by the prostitutes. Look, that's where you can get pot. We learned today that if you want coffee, you go to a cafe, and if you want pot, you go to a coffee shop. <laughs> but we're, we're, we don't want that, so we're not going to go there. <laughs> Look at the duck. I love it. It's my favorite duck. Oh, except for the two that we saw have sex. I love how long it took us to find the bench, and now it's like what we used to get our bearings. We're like, are we at the right place? Oh, yes, we are, because there's the bench. <laughs> So Lisa, what was your favorite part of my trip visiting you? Oh man, we did so much. Well, probably Efteling only because it was one of the things that I hadn't done before. That's true, that's true. And I think I liked it more than I've liked Amsterdam. Amsterdam's been good, but Efteling was cool. It's true, it was. <laughs> Efteling was really good. I don't know what my favorite part was. My favorite souvenir is definitely my Van Gogh bunny. This is my Van Gogh bunny. And his name is Nintie or something like that. But I don't know what my favorite part was. I really did like Efteling, but I also really liked the castle ruins. Maybe the castle ruins? <laughs> my memory card totally just ran out of space. But lucky for me, I brought a spare. It's actually pretty funny because it's pretty good timing. If I would like, didn't care about taking pictures or videos on the plane, I also said care really weird. Yeah. Anyway, if I didn't care about taking pictures or videos on the plane, it would be perfect timing because we're like done doing stuff now and I'm going to, going home tomorrow. Um, but I'm, I want to take pictures and videos on the plane. <laughs>